Uh, no, we didn't really anticipate it to be quite as dominant as it was really. Um, I think the, them playing zone is what really uh, gave us the advantage because at that point it was a wing stuck on either X or Nick, so uh, at that point it's kind of just an easy bucket. Kenny, they, they only made one of their first 20 shots at the start of the second half. What, what was the difference for you guys? Was it just a different defense? or I mean, uh, Just a stern talking to it at halftime, you know. Coach has really got on us and we responded real well. But, uh, we had a game plan from the beginning and we finally decided to follow in the second half. So. Do you sense that the frustration from them? Is that the going? They're not getting any buckets going in and you're kind of pulling away. Yeah, uh, I, I mean, I don't think that's the first team we've <laughs> felt that. We got frustrated with our defense. Um, and, you know, that's just uplifting as a, as a team to kind of physically see the frustration. Um, it just makes you want to keep going and just keep us in the off, really. You think you found yourself or found something with your passing this game? Seven assist? Almost got that triple double? Yeah, I mean, I wish it could have been a couple more, but. Uh, I don't know. I feel like I've been passing Nari pretty, you know, pretty well this entire year. So um, I just had some guys make some shots and you know, lucky buckets for that. So you know, if we keep going. How big of a win is this for you guys getting to two and zero in Big Ten play and beating a top twenty five team? Uh, you know, I think we really made a statement with just the overall score, um, but just. Uh, as far as the Big Ten goes, you know, you got to win all your home games if you want to ultimately win the Big Ten, and that's, our, that's always been our end goal. So uh, it's a step in the right direction. We just got to keep going from here.